The overall goal of this procedure is to avoid pitfalls when preparing frozen sections from muscle biopsies, such as creating freezing artifacts. This is accomplished by first freezing the muscle rapidly in 2-methylbutane chilled on liquid nitrogen. After the muscle biopsies equilibrate in the cryostat, they are embedded in optimum cutting temperature medium at room temperature in small increments with quick freezing using aerosol cooling and heat extraction. Next, 7 micron sections are sliced and transferred to warm, positively charged glass slides. The final step is to stain the tissue sections as needed to evaluate the tissue's histology. Ultimately, correctly prepared muscle biopsies result in well-preserved tissue histology without freezing artifacts. So the main advantage of this technique over other existing methods such as paraffin embedded tissue sectioning is that it's very quick and it does not alter endogenous antigen structure or function. This method can help answer key questions in the health and disease of muscle biology, such as growth, regeneration, inflammation, fibrosis, and necrosis. The implication of this technique extends towards therapy or diagnosis of muscle disorders because it allows determination of condition of healthy and diseased muscle. Though this method can provide insights into different forms of muscular dystrophy, it can also be applied to other systems such as cachexia associated with terminal stages of cancer and AIDS and loss of muscles in elderly populations.